During our study period, it looks like people are getting 75 or 85% of their caloric intake from corn. And actually their turkeys were eating a ton of corn too, upwards of 75 or 85% of the turkey's diet was corn. So that meant that both their, their meat that they had to eat, the protein that they were getting, and their caloric intake were all coming from corn. Were there times when corn did really poorly? If all your eggs are in one basket with turkey and maize, and maize or corn goes out the window, you could have a really hard time ahead of you. It's long been known that this area was depopulated in the 1200s, and for a very long time, it's been believed that the probable reason for that depopulation was a series of very dry years that began in A.D. 1276. We, with our simulation and our reconstruction of agricultural productivity and our estimates of the numbers of households on the landscape, have a slightly different picture now of what happened in the 1200s that might have caused the depopulation. One of the things we found is that the depopulation was pretty much complete by the time the so-called Great Drought beginning in A.D. 1276 began. There were probably relatively few people still up here at that time. So it's rather difficult to use that as the entire explanation for the depopulation. We've been looking at corn production, of course, through time, and we do see that corn production was declining throughout most throughout a large portion of the 1200s. We also see that uh, there were problems with uh, depletion of protein, there were problems with access to fuel wood. It's possible that there was some degree of soil depletion in this area. We also see that populations from elsewhere were still coming into this area in the mid-1200s despite all these problems. And we recognize that there was a, a fair amount of violence on this landscape beginning probably around 1260 if not slightly earlier. So it seems as though any one simple explanation like shortfalls in maize production is probably not going to be adequate to explain everything we now know about the depopulation. We think a much more complicated model is going to have to be uh, what we arrive at as the answer.